everyone. Welcome back. I read some comments that some people wanted to have the high score saved even after you quit the game um, of the Flappy Bird or Flappy Bat game. And this can be done fairly easy. Um, let's go into the bats and go to the FSM of game over. And let's go to the update high score. And what we're going to do is here set a player prefs. And we're going to search for player prefs set integer. And let's call this HS for high score. And the value is the global high score, which is also here because the high score will be updated by the score. And we will save this in the player prefs. Um, save the scene. Then we go to main menu and we go to this high score updater, the high score count. And what we do at the beginning of the game, or every time we go to this scene, we go say uh, player prefs get. So I already used them. So it's, it's loaded here, but search for player prefs get integer. And I'm just gonna drag this up here. And then once we write here HS, and the variable would be saved in high score. And the next time you start up the game, and if you have a high score, it will load this HS integer right into high score and then update the high score. So if we shortly demonstrate this. So it starts always with zero. And now let's try to shortly get a score. Two, three, I think uh, for testing purposes, this should be enough. And now a high score is four. And if I stop playing now, and I play again, you will see that the high score is already updated to four. And if you build the game, uh, the same result will happen. So that was just a very short update. Uh, I hope it's useful. It can also be used for any other score counters within your game, especially if it's easy scores or a number of points you're getting. You can easily just load and save them. Good. Thank you for watching. See you all next time. Cheers.